After earthquakes, devastating flash floods hit country. Flash floods triggered by heavy rains have hit the provinces of Adiyaman and Shanlapa in Turkey, causing devastation for thousands of people who were already homeless due to the catastrophic earthquake last month. Search and rescue organization AFAD said that in one 24-hour period, 136 mm 5.4 inches of rain had fallen in one area of Adiyaman province and 111 mm 4.4 inches in Shanlava, which saw a third of its annual rainfall in the past two days. The disaster has hit two Turkish provinces that were devastated by an earthquake last month. Flash floods swept away cars and inundated homes, campsites and temporary housing set up for earthquake victims. Flood water carried away cars and debris and inundated the basement and ground floors of some buildings, turning roads into rivers in central Shanlava. Turkey's Disaster Management Agency said more than a dozen professional divers were involved in the rescue efforts in the each of the two provinces. Ten teams composed of 163 people are conducting search and rescue operation across a 25 km stretch, including divers.
The raging waters caused part of motorway in the region to collapse. After the flood disaster, collapses occurred in certain areas on the Shanlapa Akkakale road. While the teams continue their work on the road that is close to transportation, it is ensured that you cut off the transportation on the road. Vehicles are not allowed on the Akkakale road, starting from the rural Matlaka neighborhood. Traffic crews have blocked the road. Vehicles are diverted to village roads. Shanlapa Metropolitan Municipality Water and Sewerage Administration General Directorate stated that after the flood disaster in the city, water cuts will be applied due to the muddy water coming from the tunnels to the treatment plants. Due to the flood disaster in province, muddy water has started to come from the tunnels to central drinking water treatment plant. Therefore, the treatment plant cannot operate at full capacity. It is important to be careful against drinking water cuts in all neighborhoods throughout the province. 